As I've said before, one of the best markers of a speech is what we take away from mm. the speech. Laura, you demonstrated on this morning that you are clearly an expert in sleep study and what we need to be doing to have better sleep. It was great and useful information on a subject that many of us struggle with day after day or night after night, depending on when you are trying to sleep. Some of us might be trying to sleep right now. <laughs> It was very well organized, as the manual suggested, so no haphazardness, clear message. You had before you the points that you wanted to share with us and made sure that you got there. Very appropriate transitions from tip to tip. We were told to limit caffeine because it takes eight hours to leave our system, to regulate our sleep hours, no television in the bedroom, or at least while you're in bed, just sleep in sex. <laughs> <laughs> or sleep if you not. <laughs> <laughs> you also told us to turn the clock around because laying there counting, looking at the clock is definitely a way to keep you awake. I have been guilty of that. I cannot even have my cell phone near me. I have to turn it over and no excessive awake time in bed. I don't know what to do with that because I actually work in bed and I know that that's everything wrong with <laughs> being able to sleep well. So very appropriate transitions and tips. And even the, the conclusion when you went back over the tips to emphasize, I thought that was wonderful. Areas of improvement. I believe that the beginning could have been a little more dramatic. You came with the yawn and right now, I'm just... I'm just <laughs> I am so tired. <laughs> and the drama of what that, what you were trying to create could have been a lot more ampli amplified. You also asked for me to look for your fillers. One of your favorite words right now is so. So comes in every, in the middle of the sentences as trying to make transitions, those kinds of things. I suggest using or at least learning other connecting words, transition words, like therefore, thus, conclusively, subsequently. That way we are moving beyond using so, so much. <laughs> <laughs> the, another tip I noticed is that you like the box step, like the rocking back and forth and side to side. If we're not going to use the lectern, which is great, then being able to actually move around the room so it's not just standing in a box and, and rocking back and forth. And lastly, at the end, as you were going back over the tips, you did the finger counting to make sure you've got all of the points. And it's not necessarily a problem to use the finger counting, but make it useful for the audience, right? So that we are also going back over the points with it. And that way it's not just your own. Let me make sure I hit everything. Otherwise, wonderful speech, and it was a pleasure evaluating you.